Come on. Don't stop clapping. Don't stop clapping. Give me that last comedian energy. Hell yeah. Yeah, man. And a, and a hand for Tony Baker and everybody that y'all saw. Man, clap it up for them. We had to take these cootie tests, you know what I'm talking about, to get out here. Got your nose penetrated, you know what I'm saying? I appreciate y'all coming out for this, though. I've just been celebrating my life out here, being a grown man post-COVID, post-cootie Armageddon. I am I'm appreciating my grown manness. I'm 35, I'm single, I'm making money, I ain't got no STDs. I only have one child. I'm doing things. I own a dog. You know what I'm saying? My baby, a TikTok baby. You know, she 10. She put me on TikTok. I ain't want to be on there. Everybody was doing the challenges. You know, y'all was challenging. Ladies, y'all was busting it. Then the silhouette challenge, that was a little unisex. Because a dude did it first. It was a stripper dude. He had long hair. He came up with like a tight T-shirt. Then he... Snatched it off and he was in the silhouette. Then the ladies was like, nice, now watch us. And we was like, yeah, y'all y'all definitely did it better. We was, put your hand on my show. Oh, oh, oh. We was, yes, amen, do the Lord's work, yes. <laughs> Red and black, let it do it in the dough way. The one everybody did, though, was the June Bug Challenge. Y'all was all out here just, boom, boom. Y'all was in random places, on cars, on top of shit, <laughs> doing it with your children. I was going to do it. My spirit wouldn't let me. I wonder why. Because there wasn't nothing wrong with the dance. Dance was cute. You go crazy with the dance. Then I played the lyrics. Have y'all listened to the lyrics? <laughs> the name of the song is called Beatbox by a young man named Spot Em Got Em. <laughs> Spot Em Got Em. <laughs> That's a nigga that's shooting you through the scope of a rifle. <laughs> you don't know if his name is James, Charles, Willie, Earl. You don't know. But if he spot him, he got him. Spot him, got him. Get, he let you know he is committing murders all through the damn song. And y'all never listened. Y'all was just out here just, just dancing to the murders. Y'all, this is a confession on the damn record. First line out, he like burn away the chopper beam, knock his legs off. <laughs> Let me decode that for those of y'all that don't speak hoodies. He said, burn away. That mean if you take off running, the chopper beam, knock your legs off. Yeah, that mean if you have a laser beam on the end of your assault rifle, he can hit you from a long ways away, knock your whole leg off. Next line, try to get away from me had a standoff. He gonna explain himself after shooting the nigga. He said, shot his legs off. Why? Tried to get away from me. <laughs> had a standoff. Hit him in his spine. Knocked his dreads off. <laughs> yeah, y'all never caught that. Yes. That's what made me stop listening because I was dancing. I heard knocked his dreads. I wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. I got dreads. Run it back. <laughs> Tony, you out here bald and free. You just, just, you out here just dancing. I got dreads. He might be talking about me in the record. I ran it all the way back from the beginning. Burn away the chopper beam, knocked his legs off. Track it away from me. Had a standoff. Hit him in the spine, knocked his dreads off. Lewody caught it, body. I nicknamed him Randy Moss. Randy Moss caught the pass from long distance with one hand. You are snitching on yourself and Lil Wody. <laughs> Thugging in my Reebok, riding with a G-Shock. OG made a sharp turn. Wody spot him, peeled the block. Shh, I heard he shot. <laughs> Draco made him beatbox. Some of y'all ain't never beatboxed before. Beatbox, blah, blah, blah. That's what sound the gun make. Draco make a beatbox, nigga? That mean you come out the car. <laughs> Y'all never heard none of that out of my mind. Draco made them beatbox in Miami. Thugging with my heat out. 
got another bitch, say she got her feet out. Another nigga's bitch? <laughs> Says she got her feet out? You out here side niggering <laughs> with the heat out? Why is the gun out if a bitch is present? Ain't no threats out if a bitch is around with her feet out. Can't be nothing present. <laughs> I'm in the club. I'm on my big goon shit. Ready to get it started. Bitch, I ain't got no sense. <laughs> he let you know he showed up with the gun and a bitch with her feet out, ready to get it started. Y'all just in there dancing. <laughs> Oh, he the plug. Riding around with boop, brick. Standing around with boop, brick. That's the what made me want to listen, because I was like, who dog was in the studio that he stepped on? He in a dance, oh, he the plug. Riding around with boop, brick. Oh, standing around with boop, brick. Get, get the dog. Get the goddamn dog out the booth. Why is the dog in the booth? Y'all was just dancing. But that ain't the first time the songs done caught us off guard. Songs be catching us off guard. We just be dancing to the bullshit. We be just jamming to the bullshit because they got a melody to it. It's been all kind of bullshit. Women be out here mad at the hoes. Hoes is winning. These hoes is winning. Newsflash, lady. These hoes is winning. I don't know when you check the scoreboard, but the hoes been winning. They been winning since the game got started. It's like 47-3 hoes in the fourth quarter. <laughs> With two minutes left, hoes have been dominating for the longest. Like, what, what made you think that the hoes weren't out here winning? Hoes been winning since the game got started. Hoes tipped the ball off, and they took it away with a definitive lead. Hoes blew y'all out long ass time ago. There's been all kind of hoe jams. Billy Paul had the side nigga anthem for a while. Me and Mrs. Jones. Doom, 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 doom. We got a thing going on. Then he started bragging. We both know that it's wrong. <laughs> but it's much too strong to let it go now. I mean, they've been fucking for a while. <laughs> Whitney had a side bitch anthem. Yeah, Saving all my love for you was the side bitch anthem of the century, ladies. And y'all was just singing it. She let you know she a hoe off the muscle. A few stolen moments <laughs> is all that we share. <laughs> You've got your family, and they need you there. Though I tried to resist being last on your list. It's me after nigga drop the kids off, get some from Whole Foods, pick up the dry cleaning, get the car washed. Then he slide through there and drop some dick off. But no other man. Not none of the niggas in your building. <laughs> Not no other man. It's plenty of single niggas out here ready to give you this dick. <laughs> but I'm saving all my love for Charles married ass. <laughs> <laughs> and women be stalking in the records. Y'all act like stalking is new. Nope. They've been stalking since your mama knew them. Retha, Lord bless her soul, stalking. Though you don't call me no more, I still wait in vain. Wait a minute, no more. In order for a motherfucker not to call you no more, that mean they ain't called you in at least three weeks. <laughs> three whole weeks have went by, Aretha, and ain't nobody called you. You still gonna wait in vain? And Aretha say, I guess I knock on your door. Y'all know! You brought two bitches with you? <laughs> tap on your window pane. What is you tapping and knocking for, Aretha? I ain't called you in three weeks. <laughs> I'm gonna stay by your steps till I get through to you. Aretha, get off that man porch. <laughs> Till you come back to me, that's what I'm going. You just going to threaten a nigga with the stalking and the knocking and the tapping. Bold with the stalking and the tapping. 
But niggas been bold too. You know who the boldest side nigga ever was? Michael Jackson. <laughs> Michael Joseph Jackson. <laughs> Lord rest his soul. Boldest side nigga ever was. Had fucked the lady one time. Had a good time with her. That lady moved on with her life. Married a king. Was living in Zamunda or somewhere nice like that. <laughs> lady liked to have little talent shows and throw little open mics at her house and shit. And the king brought all these people to perform. Swallow eaters, virus jugglers. <laughs> and they be eating the sword and shit, swallowing shit, swallow eaters. <laughs> and you swallow eat. Fire niggas, jugglers. And then somebody was like, who the last nigga? He wasn't even on the damn list. <laughs> nigga just walk out and pour dirt all on these people, brand new goddamn flow. <laughs> Michael spin his ass out the dirt. Doom, 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 boom, cap, cap, pound, boom, boom, cap, cap, pound, boom, boom, tap, cap, pound, boom, boom, doom. Do you remember yeah. Yeah. how we fell in love? Yeah. 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 We was Young and innocent then. And she, and she immediately recognized Michael, which is why she looked the fuck off. She was like, I know Michael ass ain't at my brand new palace in front of my husband talking about that one time we fucked. <laughs> Michael's like, do you remember Yo. us holding hands? Yo. She's like, Michael, I know you ain't. She got up and walked down the hallway, Mike down the hallway, and all the birds were saying. <laughs> Michael just reminding her ass. Do you remember the time, oh, I, when we fell in love? She was like, you know what, Mike? I can't, I can't let you blow up my spot. I'm going to go back and sit down by my husband and let you finish your little song. Mike wasn't through. Who jumped out the dirt? All the background dancers, they was ready. <laughs> Mike got receipts, bitch. <laughs> Mike started naming all the places. Do you remember on the phone in the dark, you and me, two, three, and what about us, girl? Do you, do you, do you? She's like, oh, you don't remember, bitch? What? I what about? I what about? Blah, da, 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 when he ate the coochie. Blah, da, da, da. Bitch, I know you remember that. Da, da, da. No, you ain't forgot that. Da, da, da. You now know another nigga hit you with the da, da, da. Toxic ass Michael all in her house. Blah, da, da. Da, da, da. If a nigga thought to die your ass, you ain't gonna never forget that nigga. His name is saved in the phone, it's Tatu Ta. You be like, bitch, guess who was at the house yesterday? Who, bitch? Michael. Uh, not Mr. Tatu Ta. Yes, bitch. Think you're ready to go, man, but before I do, I just wanna say, um, you know, God don't give you no blessing without giving you a challenge. You know what I'm saying? So, uh, in 2011, I got blessed with my only child, my daughter. And then in 2012, I got diagnosed with um, child support. <laughs> so, uh, y'all just gonna laugh like it's funny? So um, if y'all could put a little something in my cash app this evening, amen. Um, whatever the Lord lay on your heart, you know what I'm saying? Ain't nothing too small, ain't nothing too big, amen. It's dollar sign, black run. Uh, matter of fact, y'all put it on the bottom of the screen, editors. Uh, dollar sign, B-L-A-Q-R-O-N. That, that's B-L-A-Q-R-O-N. That's B-L-A-Q-R-O-N. And follow me on Instagram and social media just under the same name. And um. Other than that, man, you know, I'm just out here, you know, trying to keep them robbing, stripping, and selling dope. So, uh, <laughs> long as I can do shows like this, man, I'm gonna keep fucking with y'all, man. Y'all have a great night. <laughs> I'll see y'all. Hey, 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 Black Run, y'all. <laughs>